everyone and welcome to the sew it yourself pattern channel in this video i will show you how to sew the one size daisy dress all you need is the sewing pattern the fabric a pen to mark a ruler a scissor some pins matching threads and a safety pin the first step is to sew the side seams Put the front and back dress right side on right side and pin them together. If you have a four thread serger, you can just sew them together. If you don't have one, sew it with your normal sewing machine because jersey and model fabrics don't fray. But you can also make a zigzag stitch and then sew it together. The next step is to serge the armholes or you can make a zigzag stitch. Again, it's optional. You can just leave it like that because it will not fray with these fabrics. Take your ruler and make markings at your armholes at 2 cm. And now fold to the marking and secure them with some pins. And the next step is to sew the armholes very close to the edge. And after that we will make the neckline and the back. For that you will need the ruler again to mark on the left side of the fabric at 2 cm at the neckline and also at the back. And now fold to the marking and secure it with some pins. And the next step is to sew again very close to the edge. And after that you need your ruler again to mark at 5 cm at the front of the neckline and the back. And now fold to the marking and secure it again with some pins. And again sew very close to the edge and then your neckline is ready. And now we will make the neck holder strap. For that take your strap, fold right side on right side in half and give it a good press. And then sew both layers together. You can choose how thick you want your strap. And the next step is to turn the straps over with a safety pin. Go with the pin through one fabric layer and then put the head of the safety pin through the tube and start wiggling and pulling your safety pin down till the safety pin comes out. And then iron them flat. And now take the safety pin again and put the head of the safety pin through the tube and start wiggling and pulling your safety pin down. And if you threw the front, make the same with the back. The 
you can choose how long you want to have your strap and you can choose how long you want to have your strap so I would suggest that you try on your dress and then choose how long you want to have your straps and then sew both straps so the end and the beginning together and you can hide these endings in the neckline tube of the dress so you can't see it And now you can also make a stitch at the front and back of the neckline to make sure it always stays at the same place, that's optional. And you're done. It's a flowy one size dress but you can also sew a belt and then you have it like more tailored how you like it. Thank you for watching, I hope you enjoyed the video.